everyone, it's Maria here. How are you? I am going to give you a very short tutorial on a, an issue with uh, Windows 10 home groups. Um, this has been an issue for me for a while and I'm hoping what I'm going to share with you is going to be a fix for the majority of you. I am so grateful that it worked for me. So uh, I'm going to have a little bit more notes at the end of this, but I'm going to get to the meat of the uh, tutorial, tutorial right now so you don't have to wait on me. So before you do anything else, this is really simple. It's not asking you to delete any files or move anything. What you have to do, and, and again, this is on Windows 10 PCs. I don't know about any other operating systems. Excuse me, but uh, this is Windows 10 PCs home groups. Okay, so uh, easiest way is to click on your Windows icon, go to your settings, go to your network, go to your home group, and here, uh, because mine is fixed right now, normally what was happening happening to me here is that it was the same, it was saying that uh, you've been invited to a home group, and that was on all my, all my PCs, and on none of them could I uh, put in my passcode, none of them could I delete it. Uh, so what I ended up having to do is shut off all my PCs, and then turn on uh, or leave on one that is your main computer. I always name mine window, or workstation one, two, three, so on and so forth. So I always have a main computer uh, and that's usually the, the best one. So turn off all your computers except for the one and this is the one we're gonna go to your networking and this is where it's going to say you've been invited to a home group. If it doesn't say that then um, you might have another issue. So if it says that, then this, this is going to be a fix for you. So I just want to make sure that's, that's where you were looking at. Okay, so get out of that. Go to your Windows icon again. Right-click it. Go to Network Connections. And where your, uh, internet, um, where your internet is, right-click on that. Go to your Properties. And you should have something that says Internet Protocol version 6 TCP IP version 6. That's what you want to click on. Just click on it and then say OK. And when I did that, <clears throat> excuse me, on my main computer, it just kind of took over and all my PCs started recognizing it. And so now when I go to my... Um, networking uh, in my home group. It says home group found an, a new shared printer uh, installed printer. So it all my network was already hooked up so it knew where to find everything and when I did this I ended up getting a new uh, passcode for my home groups. So voila there it is. If this doesn't work for you leave a message in the comments because believe me I've spent all morning long <laughs> trying to find a fix so I've printed out a lot of different things and so I think this is going to help the majority of you so um, one thing I wanted to say is um, if you see anything online that says to delete files like there's this this popular posting that I've seen people sharing with each other that says uh, delete a file called Windows slash service profile slash local service slash app data slash roaming slash pure networking from your home group computers don't delete any files unless you've got some tech person that's um, in in house with you or somebody that you can rely on I've been working with computers for quite some time and I hesitate to delete anything unless I get approval from somebody so but this worked the, what I did right here and just uh, changed the TCP IP to version 6 that's it it worked for me so good luck again leave the comments uh, below if that doesn't work for you and I'll try to help you as best I can. Okay, have a good day.